Well, it's news that has absolutely shocked the world this evening as former One Direction member Liam Payne has died in Argentina after reportedly falling from his hotel balcony. The 31-year-old pop star was in Buenos Aires. He was actually there for his friend Niall Horan's tour when he tragically plunged from the third floor this afternoon, TMZ reports. It has left everyone in absolute disbelief and shock. A source confirmed to The Sun that Liam has died and the singer-songwriter was staying at the hotel Casa Sur in the neighborhood of Palermo and obviously on social media there have been floods and floods of fans paying tribute crowds of heartbroken fans are gathering behind a cordon outside the accommodation to pay tribute to their idol Liam um, witnesses at the hotel said Liam smashed his laptop and had to be carried back to his room following an erratic incident earlier in the day um, this is reported by TMZ so Cops were then called on arrival and found Liam dead at around 5 p.m. local time, which is 9 p.m. UK time, local media report. A red tent has reportedly been put up over the body as cops begin to investigate into the tragic death. And the spokesperson for the local ambulance service said Liam's death had been confirmed on the spot after he had fallen and suffered from severe injuries. Liam's final post on social media was put up on his Snapchat only minutes before his death, which has left obviously fans incredibly sad about the situation. Liam has a son. He dated Cheryl Cole and the pair had their child named Bear in 2017 and um, they split in 2018 before he was linked to supermodel Naomi Campbell in 2019. He then had an on-off three-year relationship with his ex-fiancee Maya Henry which was said to have ended for good back in May 2022. Obviously, he rose to the fame through the boy band and then carried on his own solo career after One Direction broke up. He was part of One Direction between 2008 and 2015. He released his solo album and it's incredibly, incredibly sad news that has absolutely shocked the world tonight.